Good morning, sweet friends. I am excited to show you one of my favorite things to do. Like if you want to give gifts, like to, as a teacher gift or neighbor, or you just wanna give something that's kind of heartfelt to someone, but maybe you don't have a whole lot of time. So this is one of my favorite things. I love to pick up these little peanut butter snack mixes that you can find at Walmart. And then to make it go further, because this is about $6 right here. To make it go further, I like to pop, um, this is the kettle corn. Now you can pop any kind of popcorn that you want, but I love the kettle corn because it's a little bit sweet and it will go well with your little Chex Mix. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna turn the camera down so you guys can see exactly what I'm doing, but I'm gonna mix it up and then I'm gonna put it in a special container. All right, so I just have my bowl here and I'm just gonna add my popcorn to the bowl. I'm gonna try really hard not to get very many kernels in there. So there we go. I didn't add all of that because I've got this Chex Mix, this sweet snack mix that we're gonna add. I'm just gonna toss this around to make it go further. And then I'm just gonna put it in my Y'all brand mason jar. So you take the little top off, you're gonna fill this up. Make sure you get all that good stuff in there. Okay. I'm gonna put my little lid back on. Now, the next thing I'm gonna to do to make it look really cute is I found this check fabric. And what I did is I honestly, I just took a plate like this. I traced around it and then I cut it out. I love to use my pinking shears. These are awesome. So I've got my little round circle here. And so what you do is you're just gonna put it on the top and you can make your circle smaller or bigger. And honestly, this looks a little too big for me. So I didn't test that out. I just assumed it was gonna be small enough. So I'm just gonna fold this over and then I'm just gonna cut around the edge and I'm gonna try to do it. I'm just eyeballing it. I'm just gonna cut the same amount around the edge. Now, let's see what happens. It's probably better. Oh yeah, so much better. And then you just put the little lid on and then you tighten it up. Okay, look how cute that is. And then instead of buying ribbon, I buy a lot of fabric and then just cut it in strips. So then I'm just gonna add this. Oops. I'm just gonna tie this on. Oops. <laughs> okay, you guys. I tie this on, try that again. And there you go. So you've got a cute little jar. Full of a yummy little treat. And now you can probably make, look how much I have over here. You can make, I would bet probably at least five or six jars to give to teachers, friends, and neighbors. So what did you think? Pretty simple and easy, right? I hope you try it. Let me know if you do. Take some pictures, share with me the things that you are doing. I love a good craft. I love something that's really simple. So let me see what you guys are up to. And I wanna remind you to always be stronger every day and know that you can do hard things. And I'll see you next time.